Vlog Ethics. Creating a blog is a great for anyone to share their life experiences and even advertise their business. To date, there are no actual code of ethics developed for bloggers to follow, but there are three common sense ethic codes that anyone should follow while they are running their blog posts. These are the code of ethics that will prove you as a trustworthy blog owner. Number one, fair and honest. You need to be fair and honest to your followers. You need to make sure all the information you provide is honest without adding any false information. When you are providing facts, you need to make them distinct, true, and easy to follow. Do not attempt to distort your facts. Visitors can read this right away, and as a result, you will lose visitors. If you happen to provide any information in your site that may appear to be false, you need to provide your reader with the factual information to back up your statement. If you are adding pictures to your blog, add captions underneath to explain to the reader about the picture. Fair and honest are two of the most important components of the blogger's code of ethics. Number two, harm of others. When you are creating a blog topic on a very controversial issue, avoid using anyone's names or places. This will protect you from any lawsuits and also from hurting visitors' feelings. A good motto for this code of ethic would be, say to others what you would want them to say about you. You also need to be sure that you protect a person's privacy. Invading a person's privacy is rude as well as intrusive. If you do not want someone doing it to you, then do not do it to others. A great way to avoid violating this blog code of ethic is to avoid using names or places if at all possible. If it is unavoidable, try to use as much damage control as possible. Number three, be accountable. You need to accept the consequences that may come with your blog. If you have made a mistake in any of your postings, admit it right away. Do not try to avoid it. Everyone makes mistakes, and if you own up to yours, you will be more respected in the reader's eyes. If someone happens to question your information on your blog, open up a discussion with the person. Try to see why they feel the way they do, and if they prove to be right, apologize to the person and admit that yes, you are right, I did make a mistake. If you are not accountable for your blog, you will be in violation of the blog code of ethics and as a result, you will lose followers. All of these blog codes of ethics are common sense, but also the most neglected parts of blogging. Following a basic code of ethics will enable you to be a trustworthy blogger to your visitors.